proposal that would create eight new casinos in Michigan, including one in DeWitt, be allowed on the November ballot? That's what the state Supreme Court might eventually have to decide. Shannon Cantner was in the Court of Appeals today as both sides make their arguments in this case. It's a ballot proposal that would create eight new casinos and stimulate the economy, according to its main proponents, citizens for more Michigan jobs. But that won't happen unless the proposal is found constitutional. I don't think that our opposition has proved that, that we have violated anything. We feel very confident in our, in our wording, and over half a million uh, registered voters signed our petitions and would like to see this issue on the ballot in November. But the group opposed to it, Protect My Vote, says voters won't even realize what they're voting on if it goes on the ballot as is. People think it is because this is the way it's being presented is simply a, an authorization for eight new casinos, but not not a rewrite of the whole gaming control law. And it's and it's a, a substantial reduction in the regulatory authority of the state that, that would occur. Opponents feel it will not only amend the Constitution, but also the voter initiated gaming control act approved in 1996 and a single ballot question can't do that. This is all about protecting Michigan's Constitution and doing what's right. They are not complying with the constitutional language in terms of how you put something on the ballot. Supporters say that's not true and it's just the current casinos way of preventing competition. And this is another tactic on their behalf. They don't want more casinos to compete with and this is they, they're choosing to take it to the court, but we still feel confident in our language. The court will need to rule soon before ballots are printed in September. In Lansing, Shannon Kantner, Fox 47 News. Protect My Vote hopes the Court of Appeals rules by August 15th, so that if this does go before the Supreme Court, their decision could, before, could go before the ballot printing deadline.